for the local community, yeah. which, which lives on um, tourism, like the whole Riviera Maya. So we thought, okay, if the government decides already who wants to develop the area, we need to come up with ideas how we can develop more sustainable. Right. And there we can talk a lot of things. Everything starts actually with the water, because we have no infrastructure in mostly or 80% of Tulum, and we are above the biggest underground river in the world, where basically infrastructure is not there, and you're really surrounded by nature. So you want to prevent it, or you want to destroy it? And we thought there must be an offer from a developer who okay. takes responsibility to make developments who really uh, support the area, support the community, and make more sustainable developments for Tulum, for Mexico, for the world.